When the eruption of the Sundunka crater chains of the Swartzengi volcanic system in the Reckinus Peninsula of Iceland started, the flow of the lava soon reached the L12 and L13 defensive walls of Grindavik, rubbed against things that flow toward the south, toward the uh, road, which is the circumnavigating the whole peninsula. And then toward the sea, we were predicting it would go. It will stop the car for a while. That was a prediction. But the most scary scenario was that it would come in contact with the water and create a cloud of the hydrochloric acid. Surprise, surprise, it didn't happen. The lava flow turned toward the north, backward, toward the northwest to be accurate, and went into a quarry called Melho. No human interaction in that was involved. But what we saw was a strange. Why the lava is turning back? It was thickening at the same time. It could not pass a barrier. It was not our walls only. This was the islet that actually did the trick. It's practically chucker blocked. As you will see in the different settings, when we have such a, a lava flows, these are not from Iceland, by the way, they're from somewhere else. The lava flow gradually cools down. At the front of it will become something like we call a'a. Also, around the lava flow, we will have solid ground, which actually uh, channel the flow of the lava. When it hits such an islet of cold material, of bedrock, it will turn back. This is our experience. We saw it here. And in this way, practically stops the lava flow. Ancient Iranian who live in a very tectonically active area with a lot of erosion, have to face the flood of the mud and the water throughout their land. So they found a way to actually harness this. I devised a similar method for harnessing the runny lava which flows from this uh, rift valley. And that was to build across the rift valley this kind of berms. It seems nature has done this to us, that this is an effective way in Iceland. We have to learn from this. And for the sake of the future of the town of the Grindavik, we have to devise such a system. This eruption will eventually come to an end. And this is the way forward in this system and the Krisovik and Eldwarf and other volcanic system that we have in this Reykjanes Peninsula of Iceland. To protect the towns like Reykjavik, the capital of the Iceland, which has almost half the population of this island nation.